Hello Pisces, this is Renee and welcome back. Pisces, this is going to be your reading for the next 48 hours. What you can expect, what's coming forward. What is happening in your next 48 hours. Okay, so let's take a look. Wow, two of cups. The Queen of Pentacles. The Five of Pentacles and the Queen of Wands. Okay, Pisces, and we also have the Page of Swords. So I think that, you know, you are looking for some type of information. You're actively researching or you are very curious about this Two of Cups energy. I feel like a curiosity is being sparked. Okay, um, I feel like this person may be very mysterious, um, may be very outgoing, very independent, very loving and caring, you know, and I feel like you kind of appreciate the challenges that this person has went through. Okay, um, but I do feel like love is ready to be received. Okay, with the Queen of Pentacles energy, I feel like this person or you, um, you could be taking on this energy, but I feel like this person is bringing a stability, a feeling of self-worth, um, some kind of offer is being totally accepted, you know? Um, and I feel like, you know, the rabbit usually represents some kind of fear, but she's not even noticing the rabbit. She's not even noticing that fear. So at the moment, I feel like there's a feeling of fearlessness. You know, I think you're moving out of this feeling of feeling left out, feeling left out of love, feeling left out of an offer and you're becoming more passionate more giving more assertive you're taking more action i feel like you're going to get what you want okay this is bringing a lot more passion a lot more curiosity um and i feel like your intuition is totally opening up to the situation Okay, but it's very beautiful energy, Pisces. I feel like what's coming forward for you is actually very happy, very vibrant energy. Okay? And we have the Queen of Swords at the bottom. So I feel like you're gaining a very good understanding for your situation. Um, now, like I said, this could be I'm, I'm really feeling like this is a love interaction, uh, but this can be applied to your career and finance. I feel like, you know, if this has to do with your career, I feel like there's friendships being bonded. There's an opportunity that's being given to you that's going to carry you out of your lack, out of your situation. And I feel like it's very passionate, very... Uh, I feel like you're very driven to find out as much information as possible to gain a better understanding, okay? So, Pisces. Wow, very interesting. We have the Justice card. So I feel like this energy is moving in the right direction. You're going to get something that you deserve, something that is very fulfilling, uh, something that you have a lot of knowledge and wisdom to pursue, okay? Um, the Justice card is putting the work in, you know, finding this fresh start, stepping out of your comfort zone to pursue something that you're very passionate about. Something that's going to give you balance. And I feel like you have all of the wisdom that you need to make this happen. 
you have all the wisdom to bring this stability, to bring this love into motion. Okay? So this is beautiful. This is truly beautiful for you, Pisces. Whatever this is that you're pursuing, whatever this is that you are trying to accomplish, I feel like those accomplishments are very close to you. You have a sense of having a refreshed faith, you know, being renewed, having something truly go in your favor because of the knowledge that you gained. Okay? Um, tell me more, Spirit. Tell me more for Pisces. The Two of Swords. There may be an incredibly challenging choice that needs to make. Um, you may have a very challenging decision that is going to be very impossible for you not to make this choice. Okay? But I feel like this choice is... You know, we have the justice and the judgment card right behind it. So whatever choice this is, this is definitely for your greater good. This is not something that you are going to be left in the cold with, okay? There is something that you're going to be leaving behind. There is something that you're going to walk away from, okay? Um, but I feel like... Once you walk away from the situation, I feel like you, you feel the victory already. You feel like it, it was for your greater good. It was for the future, you know, um, because I feel like there's something that you're working on. There's some kind of new idea, some kind of new venture. Um, but I feel like you have so many ideas but you're working with one idea and you're taking it and you're, you're like running with that idea, okay? Um, you're working on one simple thing to bring you knowledge and healing. And I feel like using your intuition is going to be very beneficial for you when you are choosing this thing that you are walking away from. But know that this thing choice that you're making is leading you into a new destination. It's leading you into your fulfillment. Okay? So that's something that you need to know. That's something that is very clear to me. That this choice that you're making will work out and it'll work out for better than you expected. Those are the words that I'm getting. Better than you expected. Okay? So let's get a little bit of clarification for Pisces for the next 48 hours. Okay. Okay, we have the Knight of Wands. So whatever this information is, I feel like you are running with this information. I feel like this, this that you're working on is taking you to new places. It's taking you to new opportunities. Okay? I feel like you have a renewed fire, a renewed sense of ability. You have this new vibrance about you that is you know, gaining a lot of clarity, a lot of passion. Um, I don't feel like there's any resistance to what this is that you're doing. You have the Empress energy. So I feel like what this is, is a manifestation. It's a new beginning to bring in something good into your life, okay? With this Empress card, the Empress, she's beautiful. She's attractive. She's a good parent. She's also very vibrant, 
very active in manifesting whatever it is that she wants. And I feel like with this energy of the Knight of Wands and the Empress, I feel like you're moving into this energy very quickly. Okay? Something is very fertile to be manifested. Wow, you have the Empress and the Emperor. So, if this is love that you're manifesting, this is divine counterparts. Okay? This is beautiful energy because I feel like it's coming in very quickly. Now, if this is something else, I feel like this is you gaining total control of whatever this is that you're manifesting. And I feel like it's coming in very fast for you. And you do have the possibility for love. There is an offer here for you. Okay? But this is very strong energy for counterparts. You have this power couple here in the making. Okay? So... Whatever this is, Pisces, I feel like this is something that you don't want to miss the opportunity of. This is something that you definitely want to take that opportunity and run with the ideas. If it's love, career, finance, run with those ideas. Because I feel like those ideas that you have are very abundant. And I feel like they're very clear, you know. Um, let's take a look at what, what does Pisces need to know for the next 40 hours? What does Pisces need to know for the next 48 hours? Purpose. I know what I'm here to do. And I feel like you are getting this sense of purpose. Especially with this emperor and the, this empress being here. And this queen of pentacles, you know your worth. You know your ability. This queen of wands energy, you're a go-getter. You don't stop. You don't stop at no. You know, you, may, you turn that no into a yes because you have that ability. You know, you want to do the right things and make the right decisions. We have self-esteem at the bottom. So I feel like knowing your worth is going to be very beneficial for you. I possess the gifts of the soul that benefit me and others. So I feel like your priority is to not only lift yourself up, but to also lift up the people who you are in charge of. You know, to lift up those people that you make a priority in your life. Okay? Okay, the card that wanted to jump out is the step out of your comfort zone, the North Node. Okay. And I feel like that is exactly what you'll be doing. You're stepping out of your comfort zone with this judgment card here. You're stepping out of your comfort zone and you're moving into this new ability, this new feeling of self-confidence, this new feeling of purpose. Okay. Um, there is something that you need to release. So you need to ask your question, what do you need to release? Because something needs to be released in this situation. Maybe it's your lack of confidence that needs to be released into the universe because you are totally capable you have the knowledge. You have the wisdom. Okay? So you need to know that. Um, Pisces. Okay, let's get a manifestation analogy for Pisces. And I apologize. My voice is kind of in and out today. So please look over my voice. I hope you can hear me and understand me well. Um, let's get a card for Pisces. Okay. We have full moon in Aquarius. Be real. Show people your true self, Pisces. Your true, beautiful self needs to be shown and revealed. 
reveal what needs to be seen okay and I feel like that's you know be your authentic self Pisces you are special you are capable you are the most intuitive sign in the tarot so using your intuition for in your situations will only heighten your understanding your capability and your success okay so let's get a message from the universe what does Pisces need to know the healing occurs when I give myself permission to feel whatever feels whatever feelings live below the triggers so whatever is triggering you at the moment take a look at those situations um, I feel like you will understand yourself even better by knowing why you are feeling those triggers, why you're feeling a certain way in certain situations, okay? And we also have, I always trust the direction of the universe and know I am being guided. Yes, because your intuition should tell you that the universe wants you to go in a certain direction okay let's get a love oracle for Pisces what's going on for love with Pisces please a message lightning there's going to be a sudden change you're going to see a surprising person coming into your life they're going to have some kind of surprising invitation something that you're not expecting but i feel like with this love situation this is sudden unexpected news and an unexpected offer is being given to you okay so pisces i think something wonderful is unfolding for you you know I feel like there's unconditional love there's awareness to love yourself more to become more passionate to become more affectionate more attractive um, you may be working on your look changing up your look you know I feel like there's a lot of things happening for you in the next 48 hours okay so if this reading resonates please like and subscribe hit that bell so that you don't miss any uploads and take a look at the sun moon and rising for your more for more messages for you okay i also have the march playlist up so if you want to take a look at your sun moon and rising maybe even your venus sign uh, you'll be able to find out more messages that may more, may clarify even more. And Pisces, until your next reading, many blessings to you. Love and light.